I hope y'all enjoy the place while you're here. And there's a lot to see and do. The history of Goldfield goes on and on and on. Gold was first discovered in this area in the late 1870s. Some of the ore they were mining was 300 ounces to the ton. It plugged up the stamp mills, it was so rich. Yeah, this is the entrance to the old mine. We take a lot of people down through there and show them how it was back in the day. Hi, I'm Luann Shoes, and I've been here from day one. My husband had a, a dream. <laughs> then we built the Bordello, and I told Bob I would run it only for a short time. I was a madam, Madam Lulu, for a short time, and then we hired girls. And, but I think I still made the most money of all the girls in that short time I ran it. We sure do like it, yep, and so does the puppy. That's the western face of the Superstition Mountain. Many legends about that. The Apaches were very superstitious about the mountain. A lot of people used to get lost in there. It's the incredible Superstition Mountains. Uh, I wanted to see scorpions and snakes, and well, here we saw a whole bunch of them. Well, there's no shortage of rattlesnakes out here. You can also get a horseback ride here at Goldfield. We're loving it. It's really fun. Uh, uh. The mountains and the horses and the cactuses. It's I'd like to introduce you to Yvonne Miranda. She was instrumental in doing all the research. What was here at the ghost town, at the Mammoth Mine? What was it like to live during that time? So it's very interesting to be able to come here, be a part of the history and the research of Goldfield Ghost Town. Wild Wild West. It's a lot of fun, a lot of fun. We're open. 362 days a year. I know you'll have a good time. I've, I've watched too many people enjoy the place.